All right, Mr. Turtle Shell. Badoop. I feel a little bit bad about it. He was just minding his own business. And then here I come with a sword knocking his ass off into the, you know, the veiled abyss. Hey everybody, and welcome back to like another Let's Play. The game finally came out. We're gonna play through it at the same time that I'm doing a retro play of the Game Boy Advance one. And it'll work because I won't get ahead of where I am in the retro version, provided these two games really are just a remake and everything should work out fine. Now, will that actually work out perfectly? Maybe not, maybe we'll have to, you know, play a lot more of the DX version. But if you haven't, seen the DX version, the original version, you should go back and watch that first before you watch the new one because it's a remake. You should see what the old one was like so we can, you know, compare and contrast. Anyway, we're gonna get started. Let's begin. I pressed LR. I got my Joy-Cons. I'm gonna select- whoops, bump my microphone. That's my bad. New game. Hero. Take twice as much damage with no heart drops for advanced players only? Hell no. Oh, before I... Oh my god, I can actually... Okay, first difference right here. Already. I can actually type in my whole name. Wait, hold on. S N. This is riveting gameplay. I know you all are very excited. I think on the GBA one, it's like S-N-K-T or something. It's, it's not... It's real short. Look at that, the whole name. First difference, noted. I'm gonna write a whole guide on all that. I'm not gonna do that on the differences. That was just gonna be a joke. Oh. What a relief. Marin, hi Marin. Thought you'd never wake up. No, I mean, obviously people, Zelda. No, my name's Marin. You must be still feeling a little woozy. You're on, I still don't know how to pronounce this even though I've been playing the other game. Koholent, Colent. Kaho Koholent? Koholent. I don't know. Koholent. Hi, Marin. Oh, so we can move? We don't have any kind of a sword yet. Hi, Mario. Nah. Well, Sonic, you finally snapped out of it. Name's Taren. Hope you're feeling better. What? How do I know your name? You think it's weird, huh? Well, I saw it on the back of this shield that I just stole from you. Ba -da -ba -da. Hold R. I can just hold R. Look at that. I don't have to, like, go into my inventory and assign it to one of the buttons because that's dumb. Oh, that's great. Hi, Marin. Go to the beach where I found you. Since you washed ashore, lots of nasty monsters have been in the air, so be careful, okay? I'll absolutely be careful. This looks heavier than heavy. Your current strength won't cut it. Check. Is this a stand for something? It says piranha plant. So that's, I'm assuming, amiibos. I see another amiibo stand over there. That's a... What are you doing in my chest? Where'd you learn to do such I'm sorry. That's my bad, Taryn. I'm gonna go now. Oh, already a great improvement. I can pull out the shield whenever I want. Are we ready? Are we ready for the new world? The remake world? Hit me with it. Oh my god. Do you see this tilt shift blur that they have going on here? And I know that's what it is. This is Ulrika's phone. 
We should go call over re over re Bryn Bryn. Hold on. Bryn Bryn. Bryn. It's all Rira. Ask me anything about the island. If you get lost, give me a call. You know there's a library in the village that might have some good information for you. Talk to you later. This is so cool. And we know that old Rira is right down here. He doesn't want to talk to you in person, though. I'm fine, and you? I'm great. I'm gonna go talk to old Rira. He doesn't want to talk to you, though, if it's not on the phone. He's a little shy in person. Hi, old Rira. Uh, how to say, please call outside. Seems that old Rira is a shy guy in person. Can I steal anything? This house is so cozy. Wait. What was that? Oh, there's another uh, amiibo stand. Okay, so they obviously want you to, like, buy amiibos real bad. Go buy amiibos, kids. I don't, but you you guys could. Ha! Oh, that's so nice. Kid just playing with butterflies. Hey, man, when you want to save, hit up the system screen. You get there by opening the sub screen with plus, then press an R to get to the system screen. Don't ask me what that means. I'm just a kid. They had a lot of before their time kind of jo Oh, right. I couldn't get in there because I don't have a sword yet. We got to go get my sword. That's that's priority number numero uno. There's a chain chomp. Oh, my God. And we got to give this guy a bow. He wants a bow. Makeup, jewels, dresses. I want it all. And some new accessories would be nice. Damn, this is great. Maybe village. Hello, piranha plant owning lady. <laughs> oh, bow wow. I mean, not piranha plant. Just kidding. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. Wow, 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 wow. Yeah, so there's all kinds. This is so cool. All the houses actually feel like houses now. You can jump in there. That's the library and the two kids playing. I'm not too worried about that right now. I do want to read the sign, though. Wait, what was it called? Taranbo Shores. Oh, I bet that fucking monkey's out here. Oh, that monkey. Look at this, and you don't have to, uh, the game doesn't have to load. You just go from one place to another place. Oh, look at that, you can kind of bounce them. You don't have to load screens, you don't have to do anything. And you can just push those guys right out of the way. Be aware of sea urchin. Don't touch him with your bare hands. I will not. That monkey. I know that monkey's over here. Okay, can't go that way. Don't have a sword. Fine, we'll just push these guys out of the way. Get pushed. Is there anything interesting down there? I doubt it. I just played this, but I, I'm already forgetting like where all the secrets and stuff might be. My sword! Gimme. Oh, there's the owl. Hoo -doo -doo -doo. So you're the lad who owns the sword. That's me. Now I understand why the monsters are starting to act so violently. A courageous lad has come to wake the windfish. That's me. Courageous lad. Windfish waker. It said that you cannot leave the island unless you wake the windfish. Yeah, unless you build a boat. You should go north to the mysterious forest. Okay, I'm going to grab my sword, though, first. That's important. I'm going to kill that crab right there. Then I'm going to kill that sea urchin. Oh. Uh... It must be it just has your name on it. You can swing it with B. I am I'm all about it. Oh, did you see how that crab got scared? Oh ho 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 ho. Oh, this is this is tremendous. This is so good. After especially after playing that uh the DX one, still playing the one on the DX. It's just it's insane. The the oh okay. Take two hits. They take two hits. Can I get a sword of power, please? Oh, you can just... You can swipe so fast. It's a little weird being in 3D now, as opposed to... Um, there's that monkey. You fucking... Can I just shield him back? Okay. Not really. Uh, right, and there's those boulders. And this is where me and Marin are going to have a hot date later. You just wait. You don't know it yet if you haven't seen the original, but there's going to be a hot date. I believe this is the alligator man who has the banana shack. Yep. Hi, alligator man. Welcome to Sale's House of Bananas. I'm Sale, and this is my house of bananas. Actually, he collects really weird canned food. 
Yeah, look at that. He has a hammock and everything. Your house is great. I'll be back later, Sale, with your house of bananas. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Feels good. Just feels good. It's crazy to have been playing uh, the original Link's Awakening and then to start to play this. To see, like, the difference in graphics and everything is just... It's so satisfying. You think you're gonna get me with that? Try it again. Oh, you can kind of hold the shield and swipe same time. A little bit. Oh, that's a fiver. That was a fiver. Can I cut down the tree now? Let's go into the library, just check out what that's looking like. Can't get that book anytime soon. Check. It's a bookshelf. What? You could see that? Okay. Maps and Memories Guidebook. Read the book? I guess we're gonna read it. You can see an island map by pressing minus. Zoom in or out with R. The rough parts of the map you, map you haven't visited yet. If there's a place you want to remember, you can press A to mark it with a pen. Press X to look back on your adventure. How convenient. This is us. Look at that. They kind of scratched it out. How cool. Um, there's really not much else in there. It's just books on, like, how to play the game and whatnot. Oh, I love this remix. All right, we're going to jump in the well, obviously. This is so good. Free heart. Peace. You got a piece of heart. Press plus to open the subscreen and see. Look at that, subscreen. We got one out of four. We got a green tunic, a sword, a shield. Oh. We can save and load. Okay, let's go back up. I love the music, too. They did, uh, so far, the remixes have been... Do you just hear, like, this... What instrument is that? Like a xylophone? Or, like, a toy piano? Mysterious forest. Okay, now last time I got just the most ridiculously lost in this forest because I swore to God it was actually teleporting me around. I don't know if that's actually how that works. Oh, brave lad on your quest to wake the dreamer. Welcome to the mysterious forest. Yes. Much of mystery you'll find on this uncharted colon island. Got it. Mystery. I'm afraid you may find it a trifle difficult to leave down while the windfish naps. Got it. By the by, have you ever visited the Tail Cave, which is south of the village? I've not. Go there with the key you find in this forest. I will do. The wind fish is watching. Wait, did he say waiting or watching? I have no idea. I'm gonna say, uh, waiting. But also watching. Probably. Oh! Get ruined! Now I know there's, yeah, there's a lot of places in here. Oh, God. Okay, gonna need to learn to use the shield. Yeah, there's... Can I hit him through here? I... Oh, so close. Fudu! Shield. Fudu! Where's my sword of power? I need a sword of power or an acorn of impenetrable defense. Pretty sure this guy tells you you're gonna get lost. As a raccoon, my nose is very sensitive to stuff like dust and powder. Yeah, we need to get the, the magic dust. And no, I do not mean cocaína. That's Spanish for cocoa powder. Okay, I'm already lost. Just because I played this game recently does not mean I have any idea where I'm going. Or that I remember what I did the first time I did it to get through these areas. I do know that this floor absolutely breaks. Oh, both, both because the sign just told me, but also, wow, the floor falls so quickly here. Ba -da -ba -da! 50 roops. We're rich. Uh, the floor definitely does not fall that quickly in the DX version. 0% that floor falls that quickly. Right.
don't think I can get that yet. Mysterious forest. You know your shield's very annoying. Ow. Even though my Joy-Con is sitting literally an inch away, sometimes they just have trouble, uh, just working. He, I swear to God, that guy attacked me the, the millisecond that my shield had come down. Bummer. So we need to go take the... Oh, God. Oh, there's the Sword of Power. I haven't gotten one yet. But, oh. Ow. Can you guys please... I can't... I can't get it. That's so upsetting. That was the first sword of power and I couldn't get it. Never gonna have another first sword of power. That was it. You only get one of those. All right, let's go find the witch's house. I'm cutting up all the grass because we need a lot of roops. Ah, get up, get off. Uh, I do know that you could swing the sword faster in the DX version, for sure. You could swing your sword so fast. I feel like I'm getting more roops on average. On average, there are more roops per capita in this game than there were on the DX version. Look at that, we made it out. Don't swipe at that guy. I make that mistake often in the DX version. It, he's really aggressive in this version. I don't appreciate it. Anyway, here's the witch's house. We need to go find that raccoon again after two. Hi! It has the sleepy toads tool it does. We'll mix up something in a jiffy, we will. That's fine, just take it, yeah. It's, no, I didn't, need, yeah, no, you can have it. It wasn't like that was mine or anything. You just tossed it into your pot. Take care as there's not much in there. Why not try a bit in my hut? We got the magic powder. Why? Why? Good job! Use it on your enemies and see what happens. If you're now, go to the forest, pick some toadstools, and I'll make you some more. Why is my nose itch? Okay, uh, I don't believe there's anything else we can do in here. It sets some enemies on fire, which is funny. Oh, already this is so much better. Um, in the DX version, if you don't know, your sword and shield both count as weapons that you have to assign. Get powdered! Oh, I could have talked to him. Right, that's in A Link to the Past as well. Watch this. Oh, hold on, he's gonna... So I don't know what the magic powder does, but it sets him on fire and he dies. So we can just assume the magic powered powders made of like, you know, raid and poison. Uh, we need to go find that raccoon now. Come on, don't you have anything better to be doing? Anything. There's that raccoon. I don't have time for you. Hey, check this out. Whoa, boom. <laughs> oh, we just threw cocaine all over that raccoon. He's losing his shit. Welcome back. You're gonna go get lost in the mountains later. Last thing I remember was biting into a big juicy toadstool. Then I had the darndest dream that I was a raccoon. Yeah, sounds strange, but it sure was fun. Yeah. I'm all tuckered out. I think I better sit a spell before I head back home. Yeah, you do that, that's fine. Don't let me slow you down. Tell you how to live your life. Right, so before you would never make it up here, I think. That it would just keep teleporting you somewhere else, I think. I'm pretty sure. Fairly certain. 
fairly certain. Oh, here comes the owl right on time. He could have saved me a lot of time if he just got down here and actually just gave me the key. Take the key to tail cave. Got it. I'm all over it. Windfish is waiting. Right. Roger that. All right. You know, you just, you just, you know, fuck off and I'll just do all the hard work. That's fine. Shield. Oh, I actually shielded that time. Aren't you impressed? Groponga Swamp. We can't really go any uh, further down there because we should be blocked by, I think, some rocks. Look at, look at how cool this looks. We need Bow Wow to get in there, actually. And we can't hop over holes. Whoever dug these holes is an asshole, by the way. Right in front of that person's house. Wow, these are back. You know, we didn't change zones. Not officially, at least. But the plants came back. You guys are teaming up on me, and I don't appreciate it. You've just signed your own death certificate. Unappreciated. All right, let's get out of here. Let's head to Tail Cave. Ba doom, ba doom. Groups. The graphics on this and the effects that they use are so cool. And the song in this village is also very cool. Oh, Marin should be singing a song over here. That should be neat. Marin, let's hear the song. I want to hear it. Marin, please talk. Hi, Taryn went to the forest to look for toadstools, but I'd rather sing. Listen to this. It's called the Ballad of the Windfish. <laughs> oh, you're just gonna... Right. It is a good song. It's a great song. So that is the Shrine of Dreams that we can't get into yet. By the way, that song is so much better in this version than it is in the DX version. Uh, you have four kids? Yep, those are my boys. I'm Papal. Oh, no, Papal is the one that's going to get his ass lost in the mountains later. I'll be lost in the hills later, so keep a lookout for me. Yeah, yeah, you certainly will. That's basically where I am right now in the, uh, in the DX version. With four boys look alike, even I get a little confused sometimes. By the way, my baby wants a Yoshi dolls. I saw one at the Trindy game, but couldn't get it. Check this out. I am a master at the Trindy game. I'm actually a certified master. I got all the prizes. Watch and learn. Stand back. It's going to be pretty impressive. Also, this game is real hard. Oh, wait. How much is this? 200? Your shop is a damn ripoff. Are you kidding me? Unbelievable. This is where I farmed about- Oh, magic sea cell. Did not realize there was one there. What do you do with it? You hold on to it till later. Till they talk about where you can take the magic seashells. Okay. We're gonna play the claw game. There's a way to do this where you just win every time. And they totally changed it. Okay, this is gonna be slightly more tough. In the DX version, it's just a little- it's uh, like a grid, and it just goes around in a square. One game, ten rupees. We're gonna do it. The button moves the crane, the rest is just timing. Go over to the buttons to play. Good luck. Okay, how do we do it? How do I move? X, move forward. Oh, that moves real fast. Was not prepared for it to move that fast. We did not grab it. Okay, listen, here's the thing about your game. It was rigged from the start. Yeah, I wanna challenge it again. Okay, I'm not leaving here without that Yoshi doll. Damn it. Damn it. It's, okay. Oh. No! Are you kidding me? This is just like a real claw game. Oh, you are taking all of my money. Okay, here we go. Perfect. It's like, it's pretty close. It's not perfect, but it's pretty close. Can we grab it? Come on, give me the Yoshi doll. Are you out of your fucking mind? 
Oh, claw guy. Claw guy, I'm not I'm not a happy customer right now. Boom. Too much. This is surprisingly difficult. I hate you. We're just so we're clear. Okay. No, we were so close. Give me the rope. Give me the rope. Do not let that fall out of the crane. I will. What is this? It's just falling around. And this is it. you. Okay. Okay. I wasn't even worried for a second that we weren't gonna get it. No, I'm gonna go pick up my rope. Give me my rope. Okay. We got the 50 ropes. Let's. That was. Okay, so now we're back to uh, back to how much we had when we came in. Did not even kinda grab it. Oh. Do we dare even try to get the big pouch of roops? Yeah, I think we do. Let's try. I. Hold on, where does it stop? No, I realized that it was gonna do it at the very last second. Maybe it'll just grab it accidentally. No, we knocked it off. No, we didn't even knock it off. Wait, we did. I can grab it. I can grab it. It's mine, it's perfect. It's perfectly lined up. It's moving. It moved. That's garbage. That's garbage. Now it's on the Yoshi doll. It moved while I was in the process of yeah, yeah, we're gonna play again. It's it's so fast. It moves so fast. Grab one of them. You, you're not even trying, claw machine. Oh boy, that could not be more centered. If you do not give this to me, I'm gonna riot. Don't fall. Do not fall out of there. Okay, now you can fall out of there. Okay. No, I'm not gonna challenge again right now. I gotta go pick up my roots because you're stealing all my money with your unfair game. Oh, that was magic powder. That was that was not that was not roops. Okay, I need more roops. So we're gonna have to leave and come back. Oh, that was I thought that was a big old wallet full of money. Okay, that looks good. It looks good. Don't. Oh, we almost dropped it. Oh my God. <clears throat> yeah, I want to get that 50 roops. Ah, I don't know about that one. Maybe it'll scoop it up. Am I the greatest? Don't you dare drop it out of there. I am the greatest at the crane game. I'm gonna grab I'm gonna grab that heart piece now. All it took was like a million tries. Okay, here we go. Perfect. Nailed it. Could not even be more centered if you had designed the game yourself. Give me the heart. Don't you dare drop it. He's out of business. Don't even ask me if I wanna play again. I don't wanna play again. Your game is awful. Get out of here. No. I do not wish to play anymore. I got everything I came for. And I'm basically back to where I, well, I'm half as much as where I started. Got the Yoshi doll. Got the heart piece. We could come back in here to just grab that 50 root piece to make 40 roots over and over. But that would, uh, that would take quite a while. Whoa, you won the Yoshi doll. We've been trying to do that forever. Our mom is really desperate to have one. Well, listen, that's why I came to do it because your mom and I have been seeing each other for, I'm just kidding. It's, it's joke is, um, anyway, we're gonna go give her the Yoshi doll. After I slice these bushes. Look at that. It actually seems like it's faster just to chop bushes than it would be. Will you give me that Yoshi doll? To my yes, give me the bow. Oh, 
I'll give you this in return. It's a bow. Going straight to Bow Wow. Yep. Let's go stop by Bow Wow's house before we go to the dungeon. Up. Wait, uh, better question. Where's Bow Wow's house? Yep, there it is. Nailed it. First try. Hey, I got a bow for you. You are going to love this. It's a bow just for you. I want it all. Oh, that ribbon. I need it. Will you trade it for my dog food? Yeah, sure. Thanks. Well, here's your dog food. And we'll give this to Sale's House of Bananas. Sale. And his House of Bananas. We're not going to give it to the actual house. Oh, whoa, whoa. Wait, where am I actually going right now? Yeah, the um, the entrance is off to the right. I still, even playing the DX version, I still kind of get lost all the time. It's, um... The area, you know, it's a big area. And uh, I can't get through here because I've gone kind of the wrong way. That's fine. Pick up some free roops on the way. And we've made it. Do we do the first dungeon in the first episode? I think probably the answer is yes. We've done it. Open up. Let me in this bad boy. How cool is that? Oh, there's Sales House of Bananas. We'll hit him on the way back. All right, first dungeon. Here we go. Very excited. Oh. Uh, -doop. -doop. <laughs> Give me that treasure box or a key. Okay, that's fine too. -da 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 -da. I like how everything is instrumental or orchestrated. I mean, oh, slimes, slimes! Whoa, 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 whoa! Since when did we do this fire and crap at me business? Compass. Compass required. I don't recall having shots fired at me. So yeah, it'll beep if there is a um, key in your room. I'm interested as to what the beeping sounds like in this one. That's what it sounds like. It's super obvious. All right, Mr. Turtle Shell. What do I feel a little bit bad about it. He was just minding his own business. And then here I come with a sword knocking his ass off into the, you know, the veiled abyss. Ba -da -da -da, we got two keys. Almost fell in. That was an accident. Come on, bats. Oh, the sword of power. Oh, this bat is about to get messed up. Hold on. So you have a uh, faster move speed. As well as you just demolish enemies. I hate that guy. I just wanted to get the bat, really. Um, that is a bomb area, and I do not currently possess any bombs. Woodoop, woodoop. So in the DX version, there was a room separating these two areas. And so that's why it didn't just uh, make that sound right when we came in. Oh, roops. Mine. We got a lot of keys. Got a lot of keys, not a lot of doors yet. Uh, 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 uh. Let's go this way and mess up this bat. I dare you to stand up. See what happens. You should have trap him in a corner. I guess we'll take this door first. If you're thinking I have all these dungeons like memorized because I did them recently, you are super wrong. Jump into that pit, see what happens. Idiot. Um, I can't jump across that because I don't have the feather. Spoilers. So, 
In the DX version, this room took me a long time, but this this time obviously just first try nailed it. Because that's just how good I am. Owl beak! Hello, owl, with no beak. Turn aside, spend ones with a shield. Spined. Spined ones. I have a shield. Later, bony. Okay, uh, I guess we'll just continue this way. I don't really know which way I'm going. Um, can't hop that, so we're gonna go a different way. I have decided we're gonna go left instead, and we're gonna try to, you know, not just, like, walk just right into enemies all the time. I still got one more key. I got spare keys all day. Ha! Huh. No. Really thought he was gonna shoot at me, but he did not. Oh, that's baloney! You could hit those guys through the blocks in the DX version. Now I actually have to walk around like a regular player. That, that, that wasted like at least an extra couple seconds. If there's a door that you can't open, move a square block. I moved it. Would you? Would you? Try that again. Try it again. Would you? Right in the pit. Later, loser. That's probably more rude than I needed to be, honestly. Turn aside the spine. Spine ones with a. I did that. Oh God. Should should not should not have just fallen into that pit. This is This is funny. So when I played the DX version, I was like, why are there Goombas and there's like Mario and there's all this stuff? It uh, it blew my mind to know that all of these games had been mixed together and I had no idea. It was very surprising. I can't get that because I can't jump. Ba -da -ba -da, I got the feather that allows you to jump. We're going to be jumping all over the place constantly. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. It doesn't really look like I'm getting much distance off the ground. But it is. I mean, I am. Yeah, it really does feel like I'm not going very high. That's a weird jump animation. Why am I killing these guys? Really no reason. Oh, knocked him right in the pit. Oh, that's unfortunate. We're gonna jump this. Ready? This is fun. Yeah, we're gonna be able to knock out all of this in the first episode, which is really cool. So that way I can make sure that I just kind of stay. Um, I can't get ahead of myself in the DX version. But that, that's fine, because I'm going to just, like, double up playing it. Fine, you stay down there. See what I care. Bone man. Oh. I thought I could get, like, a sneaky hit on him. Right when he came up. But no. Could not. Pop this bad boy. I I swear to you, I pressed the button to, to jump. I would not lie to you. Do you think... Do you think you even stand a chance right now? Oh god, it stopped moving. I was gonna jump it when it came back, but... Okay, my controller really is not enjoying my inputs. And that's really frustrating. I'm just gonna jump it now. Oh, cool. Got him. I really wish that my controllers would work nicely, um, because it's causing me a lot of a lot of problems. Yeah, we're just gonna not get sliced open by those guys. They even included the guys that were hanging by chains. I really. 
don't know that I remember this room. Anyway, we don't have the boss key yet. Jump it! Okay, we still got hit, unfortunately. Dad, you know, I deserve that one. 100% deserved it. We're gonna leave that room. We're all done there. Can you drop me a heart? Would that be... Would that be something you can do? Don't jump in the pit, please. Okay, no heart. Didn't even need a heart. There we go. Please, please, please. Hold on. Uh, map. Yeah, there's a chest below us. Uh, but we should now be able to go up and hop it. Hop the, uh, the gap that was there. But that poor turtle! Honestly, you- I am so sorry that you got put into the game. That's really unfortunate. Thank you, Compass. I did gather that there was a chest here. Now you can open the door to the nightmare lair. So there is still a, uh... There's still a chest. That's interesting. There's a chest just kind of floating out there in midair. Um, let's go down. We'll use that mini boss teleport to quickly get back. Yeah, still can't hop those. You can't hop those in the original either. I want to get all of the chests before I leave is all. I swear to God, I pressed the jump button. It has a weird thing where if you don't press it before you get to the edge of it, you just, you just fall. You just fall and die like an idiot. Oh yeah, we just never came this way. We got so caught up in going the other way. Sword of power. Oh God, sword of power, so great. You're gonna get hit once and be dead. That's sword of power for you. Give me that. You got a map. I kind of already had a map. Well, that's interesting. It says that there's a... Oh, right, that's the bomb door. Yeah, I have no way of opening that right now. So we're done here. We're just gonna go beat the dungeon. And I need to go right. God, God, get! Uh, and then right one more. Okay, let's let's actually jump at that time. That was good. We're making strides. Jump? I don't know if that jump was required, but it felt good to do. Let's go take this dude out. Do I remember how to beat this guy? Nope. Buzz buzz outsider. Buzz 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 buzz. Moldorm. I'm just gonna hit him with my sword a bunch. Oh, yeah, this guy. Okay, he's real mad. He's real mad. He's real mad. Calm down. Calm down, Moldorm. Calm down. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. Ba boom. Just kidding. It won't be okay. Jump. Jumping is the key. Oh, uh, ah, ha! Got him. Sword of power made that fight cake. Also, the jumping, my superior jumping technique. Boo -doo -boo -doo. My heart. Uh, I guess I should get bombs and come back so I can get that treasure. We got the violin, or is it a viola? You got the plates. It's a cello. That's close. Got my cactuar cup too. So that's the first dungeon, man. This game is this is a this is a terrific remake from someone who's currently playing Swamp, the DX version, uh, right now. To see the, um, wow, the screen is just super white. And it's like whitening out my entire face. Um, so let's go to Sal's uh, House of Bananas. Oh, the owl's back, isn't he? Ooh, ooh. 
Hooty hoot. That's your instrument of the science. I have to admit, at first I did not believe you were real. That instrument, along with seven others in the set, has the power to wake the wind fish. You must collect them all. I was instructed to give you directions. Your next goal is north in Gaponga Swamp. Hoot indeed. Thank you, Mr. Owlman. I'll be seeing you later. So now we have the power of jump, which is obviously very useful because this area is full of potholes. The city should really come out and fill these in, honestly. So let's go take a quick stop at Sal's House of Bananas. Acorn of Pure Defense. Hello, Sale. I have for you a can of dog food. It's canned food! For heaven's sake, man, give that to me! I'm gonna lose it if I can't get it. You know what, you can have it, you've earned it. You haven't literally done anything, but you've earned it nonetheless. He just ate the whole thing, can and all. That can't be healthy. That was great, I know it's not a fair trade, but here's some bananas. Ba -da -ba -da. The monkey's gonna need those later. Spoilers, the monkey's gonna need the bananas. Uh, so we're gonna go back to the village and save. This is so cool. Everything. So I don't, again, I don't know how they put, as you almost lost your life there. If you'd have hit me with that, I had to come back and murdered you. Still can't hop up those either. I think, again, I think the effect that they put on everything is called tilt shift. It makes, it just makes the stuff look weirdly kind of blurry, but also sharp at the same time. I can't really explain it. Hey guys, what's up? Hey buddy, it's serious. Yeah, really serious. Yeah, it is. The moblins came to the village. Yeah, that's right. A whole gang of moblins. Then it's for real. They all went to the house. Yeah, that house. And then they did something at Bow Wow's house. It was a really bad scene with the moblins. Might be faster to find out for yourself what happened. I definitely will. In due time. There we go. Safe. 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 Saved. Okay, so we're gonna wrap up the first episode there. That was Link's Awakening, the remake on the Switch. Hopefully you guys are digging it as much as I am. This is terrific, because again, watching the old one and knowing how that plays and then coming to this one is just, it's a lot of fun. Uh, so anyway, as always, let me know what you think. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. You know, enjoy talking to you guys about games. And uh, if you'd like to watch my uh, retro playthrough, that's still ongoing and it updates every Friday, but I'm probably gonna crank those out so I can just get done with it so I can get done with this. Um, but I'll link that in the playlist, uh, in the description below, there'll be a playlist link so you can watch that as well, so you can kind of do your own comparison, uh, if you want to. Uh, and yeah, make sure you hit that subscribe button for daily content on games you probably never heard of, except for this is a rare exception. I normally don't play games like this, but I just, I had to. And until next time, burn bright, everybody. Thank you.